fine, TJ. I mean, I I'm sure they. the farm is well intentioned. Where's your friend, Colin? Where's a fucking pig? How should I know? Don't call me out on my homeboy. Saying goodbye? Oh, I got them all. Wow. I didn't get them all for the other chapters. Hi. Hi. You're still wearing that thing. Oh. Yeah. I guess I am. It's Shit. It's easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able to... You need to let that go. How are you gonna move on? If Bigby, I... I know no. you're trying to help. No. This is just something I need to do on my own. Listen, I... I came here because... I have to tell you something. What is it? It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. I'm not sure where to start. <sighs> Faith, Lily and I, we had this plan. We are gonna find a way out. Leave the pudding and pie for good. But then Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I... I had no choice. You have to understand. You've seen how they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine the lengths they go just to silence someone who had physical Shit. evidence? Marissa, what did you do? I freaked out, okay? I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? Oh. So I told him everything. And I begged for mercy for all of us. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. Georgie didn't do mercy. You know that. He could have been reasoned with. I was counting on that. Georgie promised he'd smooth things over with the crooked man. But then... Oh, God. <laughs> Here. Cigarettes heal all. Thank you. Especially the 80s when this is taking place, I think. Or is it the early 90s? I don't know what happened. But that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while the two of us were sitting there, as he was telling me this, Faith walked in, and I had to watch while Georgie... Wait, so Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man? Back at the well, you I said... I know what I said. But it wasn't the truth, was it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. So you think that makes it okay to lie? I know he oh, wanted their death. Oh, you scandalous hoe. I wasn't going to let him get away with it because of a stupid technicality. Especially after... That night, after Faith. I tried to warn Lily, but she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I... I left Faith's head at your doorstep. I walked her over here, and I left her. So, that piece of fabric I found near there, that was you? Yeah. I cut my leg trying to get over the fence. So you... you started all this? I just... pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all huh. the time. The crooked man was counting on that. When we suffer, we do it in silence. And the world likes it that way. We just fade like we never existed. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith or Lily. Nobody cares about us. Not really. I'm sorry, Narissa. I'm sorry that's what it took to get me to pay attention. It'll be different now. You'll make things right. You and Snow. I don't know. It seems like no matter what I do, it's just... Not enough for her, or anyone. I just can't win with these people. I know it might feel that way, but they need you, Bigby. Both of you. 
You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other, and look out for us. You don't see that a lot these days. Snow doesn't really need me. I'm sure that's not true. Uh-huh. Gee, Chahamas. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. You knew when to show mercy, and you brought justice to this town. Finally. Because you brought the crooked man in, everyone saw who he really was. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. You've been given this job for a reason. And I left faith at your doorstep because I knew if anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, it was you. I hope I've at least done some good here. You've changed this place. For better mm -hmm. or worse, Fable Town wouldn't be the same without you. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. See, why would you say that? I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. I feel like we've met before. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. What hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom? They used to call me the little bird. Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. I'll see you uh, no. Wolf. Because just uh, well, I had to kill Georgie. I had to give the crooked man a trial because I already set up. No. Let's see. Special stats. I lied to him. So, okay. So, apparently, I don't think much of Beast. Bluebeard and I are similar. Of course, I want him to avoid the farm. Slapped him, imprisoned him. Fuck these guys. I wonder if Georgie gets to live. Next time, don't give her money. Hmm. There has to be an epilogue. No. Ah. Ugh, of course. Well, yeah, I'm going to pick those up, but still. There's no epilogue or anything? Come on. Ah, man, that was so good. Ah, uh. because there's this. Oh, I don't want to say because, like, if you play it, no, I just. Anyways, I'm a little drunk, so, um, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, um, watching me play the final chapter of A Wolf Among Us. I'm sorry if I haven't finished any of the thoughts that I started about what I'm thinking about, uh, The Little Mermaid and why it's important that, um, she's met Bigby before. <laughs> I have to play through it again as the asshole and because there's like two or three things that I'm not sure about but anyways 
Once again, I'm Nails at Glow, and um, thank thank those of you who chose to sit and watch for however long this was. And uh, I'll see you around. Find me. <laughs>